Hello and welcome to this course on how to create an art collection using Bueno. So now we imported all of our artwork into Bueno and we're ready to start previewing how it looks. So here in Bueno, you're going to see there are different tabs. There's a preview, manage, settings, launch tabs. We're going to focus today on the preview one. Here in the preview, you're going to see that on the left, you have all the different filters with all the different attributes from your collection. And you can just like start filtering each one of them. So for example, if you just want to look at all the wacky buns, you can just click on that and then it will just like give you that. At the same time, you're going to see here on the top that you can just like clear those filters too. You can add multiple filters and then clear them all here. Now, another thing that is really cool is that can you also just search for anything. For example, the same trait, wacky. You can just start searching for wacky and then you can start seeing all the ones. For example, let's search for crown. And then here I put crown and it shows me all the different tokens with the crown attribute. Now, another thing is that here we can see it visually. We can just click on it and see the different traits of each one. That is so cool, right? And you can even press the left and right keys on your keyboard and just like go through each one of them. And if you want a better view, you can just click on the image and then, oh my God, look at this slideshow. So beautiful. These buns look fantastic. Now, another way that you can preview your collection is here on the top right, you can switch between gallery and also metadata. Now, when you switch to metadata, this is really cool because it shows you everything but in numbers. It still shows you a little image of each trade, but it shows you the quantity and the percentage in your collection. Whenever you want to have that level of control in your collection, seeing what is going on with each one of the trades, it can show you everything right here. For example, we can see what are the most common buns. Let's just put them as quantity. You can also sort them by name. But by quantity, we can see that the buns with a heart tattoo are the most common. Really interesting. Now, if you want to, you can also just hide the sidebar. If you just want to look at everything here, look at it so nice. You can just like bring it back again. Also, something that is really useful is here, you can even change the amount of the token set. So right now, by default, it's just 10,000, but you can change it to, let's say, 600. 66. So you just change it like that and you can refresh it at any time. You can just regenerate the preview every time quickly like that. Regenerate the preview. Give me another set. Bueno, look at that. So that's a way that you can preview your collection. You can just click on it, see all the different details of each token. And you can even just preview it as a gallery. So nice. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There's one more thing. I almost forgot. You can even share this. You can even say, hey, let's go and preview a share link. Sometimes you have other people on your team that you want to, for them to just like see how things are looking. You can have a preview share link that others can see. And that's really useful. Now, another thing that I forgot, you can sort by rarity score. What? How cool is that? So if you want to see what is the rarest thing in your collection, it can give you that kind of sorting. So that's it. No more things. Bye-bye.